Okay, Pharaoh, when I ask God to get rid of the frogs, the frogs are gone. So when do you want me to pray? And Pharaoh said, tomorrow. <laughs> now I want to ask you, what kind of brand of stupid is it if you want to spend... <laughs> Tomorrow? It's like, really? See, he was still trying to get his way, still afraid that if he gave in to God's will, that things were not going to work out good for him. And I wonder how many times in our lives God's trying to get us to do something, and our answer is tomorrow. Tomorrow. I'll deal with that tomorrow. I'll start getting out of debt tomorrow. Today, I'm going to buy what I want. I'll go on that diet tomorrow. Today, I'm eating a hot fudge sundae. <laughs> Come on, let's get it down where we live with it. You know. <laughs> I'm going to start dealing with my temper tomorrow. But today, I'm mad. I'm going to go apologize to that person you've been telling me to apologize to, but I'm going to do that tomorrow. <laughs> today, I have other things to do. But see, today is the anointed time. Now is the time of salvation. Last night, 368 people gave their life to the Lord. They had an understanding of today. Amen? And I hope there weren't, but there could have been other people who walked out and said, another time. I do believe everything you're saying, but I'm just not ready yet. Well, you know, what if we get ready and then God's not ready? What if Jesus came tonight and you weren't ready? And you know, I'm not just talking to the people here in this room. I'm talking to all the millions that are watching by television in many different parts of the world. And I'm just telling you, today is the day of salvation. Today is the day to hear the Lord calling you and, to say, and saying, it's time for you to come home. And there's a number on your screen right now. If you want to call our office and ask for uh, some information about receiving Christ as your Lord, if you want to know how you can have your sins forgiven, how you can just have peace and know that you're going to go to heaven and begin to live a fruitful life, call that number and let us give you some information. Or if you already know all this, but you just want to make a commitment to Christ, call and let somebody pray with you and lead you into a walk with God.